steal any of the limelight from the man who is very much in everyone's thoughts. As we go into the he's season now going to make his final end of season speech as manager so of Manchester as the United. Of English football, the most revered club in the land. Many clubs aspire to be champions, and in the 21 year history of the Premier League, only a handful have scaled this mountain. We, as the reigning champions, have history at our mercy, and our destiny is firmly in our own hands. One man who has been part of the tapestry of the history of this club has won five FA Cups, four League Cups, ten Charity Community Shields, one European Cup Winners' Cup, one European Super Cup, two Champions League titles, Intercontinental Cup, one FIFA Club World Cup, and 13 Premier League titles. The impossible dream made possible by the greatest British manager ever, Sir Alex Ferguson. Well, I've absolutely no script in my mind. I'm just going to ramble on and hope I get to the, to the core of what this football club has meant to me. But uh, first of all, it's a thank you to Manchester United, not just the directors, not just the medical staff, the coaching staff, the players, the supporters, it's all of you. You have been the most fantastic experience in my life. Thank you. Uh, I have been very fortunate. I've been able to manage some of the greatest players in the country, let alone Manchester United. And all of these players here today have represented our club the proper way and won a championship in a fantastic fashion. Well done to the players. My retirement doesn't mean the end of my life with the club. I'll be able to now enjoy watching them rather than suffer with them. <laughs> but if you think about it, those last minute goals, the comebacks, even the defeats are all part of this great football club of ours. And it's been an unbelievable experience for all of us. So thank you for that. I'd also, I'd also like to remind you that when we had bad times here, the club stood by me, all my staff stood by me, the players stood by me. Your job now is to stand by our new manager. That is important. I just... Before, before I start bubbling, I just want to pay tribute to Paul Scholes, who retires today. He's a... Unbelievable. One of the greatest players this club has ever had or ever will have. Paul, we wish you a good retirement. I know you'll be around and annoying me. But uh, also I'd like to just say a little word wishing Darren Fletcher a speedy comeback to our club. <laughs> the players... I wish the players every success in the future. You know how good you are. You know the jersey you're wearing. You know what it means to everyone here. And don't ever let yourself down. The expectation is always there. So, 
I'm going home. Well, I'm going inside for a while. I just want to say thank you once again from all the, from all the Ferguson family. They're all up there. I love and grandchildren. Thank you. Thank you. Sir Alex Ferguson saying goodbye. No script. Speaking from the heart, describing his experience at United as the most fantastic experience of his life.